How's it going, guys? And welcome back to another JHR review. And today we're going to be looking at something really interesting. And it's kind of funny because it reminds me of something I used to do as a kid. We'll get to that in a minute. This is a crispy ramen snack. It's garlic flavor, and it's by Baby Star. I found this at uh, Motokai or Tokyo Central. And then uh, on the back right here, it says, no need to cook, ready to eat. And from what I said at the, be at the beginning is, it reminds me of the end of the already done ramen packs, where you take it out and then you kind of sprinkle some of the seasoning on it, or you just eat it hard by itself. Except it's packaged as an actual snack. Let's go ahead and zoom in on the nutritional information real quick. It's probably not great, but we have... 530 milligrams of sodium in the entire thing and about 45 carbohydrates as well little to no actual sugar and the fat is on the higher end has a very cute little design on the front looks like she has a magic wand without further ado let's open this guy up and see what this tastes like I wonder if it just tastes like kind of ramen noodles covered in flavoring. Let's go ahead and try it. So, this is what the inside of the packaging looks like. Let's go ahead and pour some out on my hand. And zoom in on it. So this is what they look like. Kind of, uh, it's like a bit of crispy ramen. It's like it's set on the front. Yeah, feels just like the same consistency too. Let's go ahead and try this out. So, I would say that this is a little softer, or maybe the noodles are slightly thinner than actual like ramen ramen. What would be really interesting for me is if you got some of this and instead of eating it as a crispy ramen snack, you tried actually boiling it and seeing whether or not you could get it to taste like actual ramen. Kind of see if it's made of exactly the same thing. What do you guys think? Would you try that out? Try to make your own homemade cup of noodles or something like that? But it's really interesting. I've never seen something so based on what we all kind of know that we do. Um, you know, when you try the end little little bits of the ramen at the end, we all know we do that, but we never thought an actual snack would be made out of it. Pretty cool stuff. Really enjoyed it. The garlic flavor's there. Not too much of a powder on it. It's just already in there, so it's not going to be super messy. And I don't really have anything on my hand either. But yeah, definitely would recommend this. I'd say it's a good uh, 10 out of 10. A huge shout out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your support. You guys are awesome. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.